Rosh Hashanah is a two-day celebration of the Jewish New Year, which literally translates to Head of the Year in Hebrew. During Rosh Hashanah, we commemorate God's creation of the world and ask God for forgiveness for things we have done during the year. It's a time for prayer, good deeds, and reflecting on past mistakes. When is Rosh Hashanah? Rosh Hashanah is a two-day celebration that usually occurs in September, but is sometimes held in October. What happens during Rosh Hashanah? Unlike New Year's celebrations held on December 31st, Rosh Hashanah is a somber holiday filled with prayer and self-reflection. Many Jewish people spend much of the holiday in prayer at a synagogue. The shofar, which is a curved ram's horn, gets blown during prayer services. The shofar is symbolic and represents a wake-up call to reflect on personal lives, focus on repentance, and explore ways to become better people. After the religious services, many will return home for a festive meal with symbolic food. Meals during Rosh Hashanah typically consist of challah bread, which symbolizes the cycle of the year, pomegranates, which symbolize being fruitful, apples dipped in honey, which symbolize a sweet new year, and the head of the fish, which symbolizes the prayer, let us be the head and not the tail. It is customary to greet each other by wishing each other a happy new year. There are several ways to do this, but the most common phrase is Shana Tova. Why is Rosh Hashanah a Jewish festival? Rosh Hashanah is a Jewish High Holy Day. On this day, Jewish people believe that God looks at each of them to see what they have done, good and bad, in the previous year. Overall, there are only two holy days, with the second being Yom Kippur, which occurs 10 days after the new year. What is Yom Kippur? Yom Kippur, also known as the Day of Atonement, focuses on forgiveness, fasting, prayer, confession, and community. It is considered to be the time when our souls are closest to God. When is Yom Kippur? Yom Kippur takes place 10 days after Rosh Hashanah. What happens during Yom Kippur? Based on the teachings of the Torah, Jewish people fast on the Day of Atonement. It is believed that if Jewish people fast on Yom Kippur, they will be forgiven for their sins and cleansed by God. To prepare for fasting, there is a festive meal served to all family members, which is the concluding meal before the Yom Kippur fast. On the eve of Yom Kippur, Jewish families gather together at the synagogue and recite verses from the Torah. At prayer services, men and women often wear traditional clothing to mark Yom Kippur, such as a kittel, which is a long white garment for evening prayers. The Yom Kippur observance lasts 25 hours, beginning with the lighting of two candles 18 minutes before sunset with prayers of blessings. After Yom Kippur ends, many Jewish people have a break the fast celebration, which may be held at a synagogue or home. This is a time to eat and spend time with friends and family. This time of the year is a great opportunity to learn more about Judaism and the wonderful Jewish New Year festivities. For resources related to Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur, head to twinkle.com. Shana Tova!